Hey guys, and welcome your faces back to some more Minecraft mods. So I found, or I was playing with some mods, and some of them I, in particular, I really, really enjoyed, really liked. So I thought I'd show them off to you. These are my favorite top 10 Minecraft mods. And if you want to go ahead and install them, download them, they will be in the description down below as always. But I hope you enjoy. Now for this first mod, it's called the Cubic Chunks. And what it does is pretty much sets the max height and depth. You can build past the amount, past the height that Minecraft usually sets it to. So that's why all these, you know, landscapes, pieces of uh, mountains here are just way past the normal <laughs> depth in that. Uh, but and also going down below too, you can also go further down for the below. I'm not sure about bedrock, but this is insane. So onto this next mod, we have the dot hat mod, which pretty much gives you a huge source of new weapons. Of course, not vanilla type Minecraft weapons, but just weapons in general. If you ever want to change up how it goes and, you know, use some stores that are different here. These are pretty, pretty cool, pretty, pretty all right, not bad. I like it because it gives it another kind of feel to the game if you ever want to change it up because, you know, it's Minecraft, so you want to get that other adventure RPG feel for it. On to this next mod, we have the Wild Nature mod. Now, it adds a bunch of new things to the game. As you can see, flowers, pigs, a whole bunch of different resources. We got some other cows here, and the look on them are different, of course. Oh. They got little horns instead. They've got actual udders this time. Here we have some ducks. I believe we got some bison here too. These are pretty, pretty, <laughs> these are pretty interesting animals to say the least, of course, bison. And then for the last one, we have the camels. I believe these are really, really cool because I think you can get saddles and ride them. Not only on top of that, we also have the visuals mod and that gives this game a more kind of real Minecraft feel, even though it is, you know, block-esque type. Mm. Onto this next mod here, we have Time and Day mod, which allows you to add in your real time into this game. So it'll tell you what day it is, what month, what year, so and so. And you can also change the amount of time the daytime and or nighttime lasts. So the cycles that come and go, it'll actually let you choose and you can pretty much configure that in the mod itself. There's like a little config notepad you can just go around and just see what you prefer, what your preference is when it comes to the daytime and that. All right, so for this next mod rolling in here, we have the Better Portal mod. And pretty much what that allows you is you're able to build a, you know, a portal to the nether, and you can literally just walk through rather than having the little time wait loading screen and everything. You just literally walk through and that is it. You're in the nether, you can see back into your world. This is actually one of the coolest mods I think I've seen in a long time and the one I've been using for quite a bit now. This thing is absolutely insane. I also have another mod rolling in on top of that one, and it's called the More Nether. Now, what this adds is pretty much more structures, more items, things you can actually farm, plant-based stuff to the nether, warts and that all. Let's go around and check some of this stuff out here. So this is a lot of the structure stuff I was talking about that I kind of added. I mean, some of this has already been here. This is like fortress stuff too. As you go down here, come through this huge library. You go over here, there's some wicked monsters. This is like a shrine here. This is this is probably one of my most favorite mods. Better portal mod and the more nether. As for the last two mods, I'm going to be showing you the first one's called the Midnight mod, which allows you to go into a place called the Midnight, which is a nether realm in Minecraft. It gives you a little red portal you walk through, and this is what you'll see when you go through. You'll have some spirit deers, you'll have different monsters. There's also different storms that light up, there's red clouds. And then on top of that, you have the illumination mod in this one, where it just lights certain things up with certain type of different visuals. So I think that's pretty cool. They kind of both complement each other. I hope you enjoyed these mods, I really do. They will all be in the description down below if you do want to play with them, if you do want to, you know, download and install them yourselves. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for the support. I will see you guys in my next video. This is Raya Pandas signing out.